Ooh. Hello everybody on YouTube. Thank you for joining me in another video in the channel. Today I'm doing an interesting video. Today I'm getting stung. Where did you go? Today I'm getting stung by the keyhole wasp. Yeah, different container this time better. Uh, let's do this. Yeah, you can see it clearly through magnifying glass. So guys, uh, information about the keyhole wasps is how we get to this thing is uh, they, these wasps, about six to nine millimeters, I think this one is about nine or eight, uh, they get their name due to them nesting in uh, little screw holes in airplanes. So they make uh, flying uh, concerning to though to the mechanics because when they nest there it usually messes with the mechanics of the airplanes um, n there no crashes happen but like there could be a loose area and it's because of these wasps and people have been trying to you know get them away from that area so they don't you know mess with any more of this stuff uh, this wasp is closely related to the to the warrior wasp because it happens to be in the same family as it. Um, they're not aggressive and they look a lot like the Mexican honey wasp. It's more like a mimic, but it's bigger, huge. So, yeah. Uh, welcome to the Keyhole Wasp Stinging video. Okay. Open this up. Set the container once again. Still trying to find the queen red paper rolls. I haven't seen any red paper rolls lately, so that's why I haven't been able to do it. But I will get to her shortly. She is the keyhole wasp. Are you guys ready? Three, two, one. Ooh. Ah. Ooh. Yeah. Mm hmm. Wow. Oh yeah, that that really does hurt. Ow! It's like a rampacious panther instinct. Hmm. So yeah, it's like a it's like a like a two in my opinion. It's not that bad, but it will startle you if you do get stung. Uh, that's all I have to rank it. I rank it as a two. It's not really that bad, but yeah, I warn people if you see the keyhole wasp, they're gonna fly away from you. But if they are aggressive and they try to attack you. <laughs> Get away from it because it will hurt. Yeah, not more painful than a paper wash sting. And not as painful as a harvest strand sting. It, it could compete, but the harvest strand sting takes it to the next level. This one does not. So it's, it's like a huge mosquito bite. That's what it feels like. I have to take three stings for you guys to see. And you know, I'm good. I'm good to be taking these things for you guys to educate you guys. Um, but yeah, then again, don't confuse it with the, don't confuse it with the, with, with the, what's it called, the Mexican honey wasp, as you can see from right here, uh, Mexican honey wasp is a lot smaller and a lot thicker than this wasp. So this one is nine millimeters and the Mexican honey wasp will be about six. So yeah, that's all I got for you guys in this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. And if you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave a like. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already so you don't miss any of the newest videos. And hey, comment down below what you guys want me to get stung by on the channel. I am still going to try and get stung by the Queen Red Paper Oz. Because, again, she is the most painful, one of the most painful things that I've taken in my whole lifetime. Uh, that's all I got. My name is Mango Juice, and I hope you guys are having an amazing day. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Stay juicy, everyone.